dress for your shape because just because you like something doesn't mean you should wear it necessarily. Exactly. You really want to, you know, accentuate the good assets that you have in, in your body type rather than, you know, just cover everything up. You really want to show off what you have that is positive. Sure. And we all kind of fit a certain body type. Let's talk about the pear shaped where you're a little heavier on bottom than on top. Yeah. With pear shape, um, you really want to stick to classic cuts, things that are fitted on the top, uh, full skirt on the bottom. Um, and that helps to give the illusion that your uh, body is proportion. Um, having a deep V neckline like Mary has in her dress here helps to draw attention upwards um, and then a nice pretty elegant necklace um, and it really balances out her body and the short skirt also um, helps to elongate her legs. And I notice we're having, we're seeing a lot of floral prints mm -hmm. here. That's okay no matter what size you are or what shape you are. Yes, yes. Okay, great. All right, long and lean. Long and lean. <laughs> come in there. Well, what you really want to do is max maximize your long and lean stature. So you really want to choose something that's a long length. Since you are slim and tall, you can definitely pull off bright, bold prints mm -hmm. um, and, you know, show a lot of detail. We've got a, a big, bold uh, ring. We have a chunky bracelet. Um, and then you can also give the look of uh, curviness by putting a belt around the waistline like we did with Emily. I was going to say, I like that belt. Did the belt come with the dress or was that something she kind of threw on there? That's something that we added. Um, it did not come with the dress, but yeah. yeah. Very cute. All right. And then petite, there's a selection for there as well. Yeah. Well, um, if you're a petite woman, you definitely want to choose a style that is fitted along your body. So um, stay away from things that are skin tight, but a great uh, way to do this is by choosing a sheath dress like uh, Denise has on here. Um, and then the short hemline helps to elongate her legs. Um, and then when you're petite, you want to have something that has like one strong and embellishment or detail. So her ruffled neckline, mm -hmm. um, and it's a V-neck, so it helps to elongate the upper half of her body as well. And then you don't need to go crazy with accessories when you're petite. You can just do a simple purse like she has there, um, a bracelet, and then a simple earring. So we're going longer if you're taller and shorter if you're shorter. Yes. Pretty much. Okay. Yeah. And then finally, plus size. Um, well, Beverly is our plus size model here, and she is wearing um, a lightweight A-line dress. Uh, when you're a plus size woman, you definitely want to stay with something that has some structure. Um, so this one uh, has some piping around the waistline to mm -hmm. accentuate her waist, with the, which is the smallest part of her body. Um, and then, again, the short hemline helps to elongate the lower half. Uh, deeper neckline helps to slenderize her oh, upper half of her body. In there. Yeah, and then she has a shrug that gives you a little bit of coverage over your arms in case you don't want to show them. Mm -hmm. And then real pretty, elegant jewelry. Now, I noticed we talked about the floral prints. What about colors this year? Colors, you definitely want to go bright. Um, color is making a comeback, so is floral. So, yeah, just... Have fun with it and enjoy spring. Kind of something for everyone yeah, out there. And definitely. I was saying, I was just asking you ahead of time if the weather is kind of uh, playing a part in, in very non inspiring shopping yeah, at this point. I know, a lot of people buying pants and capris rather than dresses. But hopefully, you know, with Easter and the weather is supposed to be better, we'll, we'll have everybody in. If there are flowers, you want to buy flowers, right? Exactly. Right. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Christina Walker. Thanks and to find me. one of many Dress Barn locations nearest you, just log on to www.dressbarn.com. Thanks again. Thank Thank you. And we'll be right back. And Rena.